what, one of the other experiments that's been going on has been, you know, really these, these new vertical search engines. We've got the Google Hotel experiment, uh, Google Flight Search, or the financial comparison products. Uh, and it was confusing to me when, when you relaunched the units on Google to point people to them because I was told they weren't ads, they're not organic, they were a third thing, but nobody could kind of define it. And, and as I talk more, and I'm talking with the ad side of the, the house at Google, they were explaining that you know, well, you're included in the hotel experiment because you've been, and there's some sort of paid inclusion process that's going on. Or that you know, the, the, if you're in the flight search, you paid, or if you're in the financial thing, you're there because you paid. And I was like, but back in 2004, Google said paid inclusion was evil and it should never be done. So what, is that changing now? And as we get new future vertical products, are they running out of your area or the ads area? Or so uh, it's, a, it's a very good question, Danny. Several of uh, you may have noticed this new sponsored box uh, that we put on top uh, uh, sometimes when it's uh, useful. And fundamentally, time and time again, we started noticing that a class of queries could not be answered based upon just crawled data, be it flights from Boston to San Francisco or you know, low-rate mortgages. And time and time again, we were failing our users for such queries. And we realized that we will have to either license data or go out and establish relationships with data providers to get that data. In that relationship, sometimes they may pay us too to be there. Or in several cases, there may be no money exchanged. However, it's still a deal between Google and a data provider. And to be super safe, where we have a deal between Google and another party, we didn't want to call those fully organic results because they're based on a deal. Uh, and therefore, we struggled for a long time to say, hey, uh, what, what is this? This is not really an ad because there may be no money exchanging hands here. Uh, and this is not really search because it's a deal cut by Google's uh, deal department with someone else's deal department. Mm -hmm. However, it's awfully relevant to the query. I mean, if you want to get flights from Boston to San Francisco, uh, Google Flight Search is outstanding. And after much debate, we said, OK, let's be extra cautious. Let's call it sponsored so that we tell our users that there's a special relationship that Google has established with someone. And sometimes it does involve money. That's true and basically mark this out of the organic area, and that's what we do. But will, that, will that change in other kinds, of, like shopping search, for example, you've got data feeds that come in, but nobody pays to be in shopping search. Uh, my assumption is that's because you have a system where you don't need to have those kinds of deals to get the data that you need? We, we, in every area, we are looking at what's the best possible okay. model. And, and, and like every product that Google builds, we think and rethink and redesign. And I mean, I can't say anything right now how shopping would evolve. Uh, but clearly, all these areas are, are ripe for innovation, and that's what we are going to do.